human form is something significant in the cosmic order. And that's a scientific finding. It's implicit in astrobiologists thinking about looking for carbon-based life somewhere else and looking for oxygen on a planet. In my view, discovering the fitness of the universe, the unique fitness of the universe for carbon-based life and beings like ourselves is one of the major discoveries of 20th century science and one of the major discoveries of all time in the area of design, religion and science and all these sorts of things. If you look at the properties of the carbon atom, it's the only atom in the periodic table, really, that you can build a vast diversity of complex chemical compounds with. That if, you, if you're going to build complex, uh, self-replicating chemical systems, you're going to have to choose the carbon atom. Oxygen is absolutely critical, and oxygen is the only fit atom for carbon-based life to give the energy you need for highly active organisms like ourselves. And if you're going to be highly active organisms like us, with a high body temperature and a high metabolic rate, you've got to use oxygen. All carbon-based life is based in water, okay? Every single carbon-based life that's ever been found is based in the matrix of water. And water is fit for all carbon-based life. But if you look at certain ca characteristics of water, you find, again, they seem to be facilitating our sort of existence. The universe is fit for carbon-based life and fit for higher organisms used, utilizing oxygen. And that is not my view, that is the view everybody working in the, in the field of astrobiology and everybody working for NASA. Essentially, 20th century science has demonstrated this fact. This is one of the most important demonstrations in the history of science, because it means that, in fact, human form, human biology, has some sort of a special place in the order of nature. The human form is not some irrelevance, not some freak of nature. It's deeply significant, and, I, and I, for me, I think, I can't think of any discovery that's going to come in the 21st century which could be more significant than this, actually.